Welcome back to Behind the Hero. Tonight's heroes are the duo who recently restored peace and order to our galaxy, Ratchet and Clank. So, gentlemen, tell us about your latest incredible adventures. Well, as you can imagine, we've been pretty busy. After Drek's defeat, there were parades, press conferences, fancy dress balls. And the wiener roast at Al's. Oh, yeah, that. And then things started to slow down a bit. After that, we, well... There was the grand opening at Groovy Lube. Right. I think that was last week. Six months ago. We're still pretty busy, but in a more, um, domestic sense. Yesterday, I flushed out my radiator core. I guess no one needs a hero right now. Miss Bluebottom, I found our man! What the? I am Abercrombie Fizzwidget, founder of the Megacorp Company in the Bogon Galaxy. Bogon? I'm sorry to incapacitate you, but our entire galaxy is in a very precocious situation. I must humbly request your sustenance on a mission of dire urgitude, a mission of superfluous peril, a mission of unequivocal imperitude. Did that make any sense? So, you need me to go on a dangerous mission in another galaxy? Indubitably! A few days ago, this top-secret biological experiment was stolen from our testing laboratory by this duplicitous criminal mastermind, and I need you to get the experiment back. We'll do it. We will. Frank, I have precipitated your recalcitrance and have made special improvisations for you. We are prepared to give you a job as the head accountant for Megacorp, plus a penthouse suite in lovely Megapolis, and our state-of-the-art robotic masseuse. Deal. As for you, Ratchet, I'll need you in superlatory shape. While in transit to the Pokemon Galaxy, you will undergo heavy training and conditioning, including martial arts, heavy weaponry, survival skills, stealth, lacrime, ballroom dance, and origami. We've used bipolar vector regurgitation to track the thief's location to a flying base in Sector 7. It will tribulate the base and retrieve the experiment. Sir, ready for launch. Thugs for less. If it ain't broke, we'll break it. Right. I'm in the market for some security. You bring the cash, we'll bring the thrash. Good. I need your best men to meet me at these coordinates. Do you have any maps for this quadrant of the galaxy? You bet, mister! We got galactic maps, 3D maps, fold-outs, cutouts, maps to the stars, and their homes! Sorry about that. Ah, oh, I forgot my wallet. Could you, you know, take care of this? Perimeter defenses deactivated. You forgot your change. Ask yourself, are you man enough, hero enough, insane enough to step into the ring with two of the fiercest warriors in the galaxy? If you answered yes, you're a big, fat liar. But that's okay, because Megacorp is bringing galactic gladiators into your home for a special Mega View event. First, it's survival of the fittest in our bio competition. Be there as Chainblade, Chainblade, unleashes his fury on our gladiator guest contestants. Chainblade has gone undefeated in 500 straight matches. But if the bio division doesn't do it for you, our robotics division will. Taste the adrenaline as contestants face off against our four-armed bandit, the B2 Brawler, Brawler, Brawler. No living creature is a match for this machine. Watch six tons of carbonox alloy hunt for its prey. There's no consolation prize, cause this bad boy's programmed to show no mercy. So, what are you waiting for? Call now to bring Chainblade and the P2 Brawler into your living room. But put away the fine china. <laughs> the Galactic Gladiators, only on Mega View. Call your provider now. Skin, the bugs in your teeth. We are the Desert Riders. 
Before I became a desert rider, I didn't fit in anywhere. I had low self-esteem, bad breath, and a thing for ladies' undergarments. <laughs> but these guys understand me. They really do. Yeah, I'm just here for the bake sales. <clears throat> oh yeah, yeah, I also make these cute gloves for all the guys. So if you've got what it takes, use this temporary membership to enter the most grueling hoverbike race in the galaxy. Win it and become one of us. Desert Riders, the number one leisure choice of Thugs for Less. You have no idea what you're involved in. Return to your old galaxy immediately. Or this will happen to you. Or this will happen to you. Farewell. Attention all Thugs for Less employees. First of all, Whatever slug brains been eating all the choochy bars in the break room, better quit stuffing his face, or I'll... Hey, turn those lights off! It's bad feng shui. Ahem. <clears throat> Next, our space rendezvous point has been moved to, and listen up, knuckleheads, the Felsen system in sector 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If you're no good with numbers, find a buddy to help you. Lastly, the company picnic is this Sunday. And don't forget to bring your own juice this time. Hey! I saw that, Cletus! You just turned yourself a writer! For the fifth time, I have a collect call to Thugs for Less from a Mr. You Are Gonna Die. Will you accept the charges? Uh, you are gonna die. I'll take that as a yes. Thank you. You idiot! <gasps> Uh-oh. I'm paying top dollar for your protection, and your moron employees are off at some picnic! Hey, that was a bonding exercise. Hey, not! I'm at the pickup point now. If your men aren't here pronto, you can kiss this contract goodbye. Uh, oh yeah? Well, you can kiss your, uh, uh, your, your, uh, you know what I mean. Uh, dang it. The man, the myth, the legend, the loser. Captain Quark, once the idol of everyone in the galaxy, has finally hit rock bottom. After his humiliation at the hands of Ratchet and Clank, Quark sold bogus merchandise he claimed were Gadgetron products. But a key defect in this product, the Personal Hygienator, caused severe irritation in sensitive body areas and alerted authorities to Quark's scam. Behind the Hero will return after these messages. Psst. Got a ship that needs a... Uh... Improvements? Worried about getting caught? At Slim Cognitos, your secret is safe with us. Whether it's weapons, shielding, or a new hyperspace module, we'll hook you up quickly, cheaply, and most important, quietly. So next time you're in the market for some uh, legally ambiguous refashioning, remember the name. Slim Cognitos. The only inspections we pass are yours. Hello, yes. Hey! Oh, oh, oh. Yes, I need to order two more containers of sulfuric acid and... Oh. Oops. Uh, better make that five containers and uh, four containers of liquid hydrogen. Oh. Oops. Uh, better add six crates of nitroglycerin and... Oh. Oh, just give me double that boy! And I need it delivered! Megacorp Manufacturing and Mining. A tireless drum major leading the galaxy on its march of progress. Come to our desert mining facility and see why our most precious product is our history. When we first arrived, we found a planet completely overrun by rainforest. To better accommodate the local wildlife, we transformed this impassable jungle into an easily navigable desert. Ever the technological pioneer, Megacorp invented the automated management team, thereby eliminating costly upward mobility, and all the while making your life richer. Megacorp Manufacturing and Mining. Our march continues to the tune of progress and profitability. Call Investor Relations today. Oh no! Good thing that wasn't little Susie. Here at the Megacorp Testing Facility, we make sure the products you buy are safe for you and your family. 
These are just a few of the products we've rejected to help keep you safe. The Tiny Tot Slingshot, the Nuclear Mousetrap, Self-Wedgifying Underwear, and the Lawn Ninjas. So the next time your toaster doesn't explode in your face, say a little thank you to the Megacorp Testing Facility. Welcome back to Behind the Hero. In yet another setback for the embattled Captain Quark, the Galactic Court ordered him to pay six billion volts in damages to citizens suffering from personal hygienator syndrome. Only two days later, Quark was arrested trying to flee to Pokotaru. The one-time hero, now full-time Zero, was placed in custody awaiting trial. But the next day it was discovered that he had escaped, flushing himself to freedom. We will return to Behind the Hero after these messages. Welcome to Megacorp Games, sponsored by Megacorp. Okay, Megacorp contestants, get ready to grapple with our Megacorp Gladiator team. And if you survive that, enter the Megacorp Battle Arena with our Mega Spider Bot and our Mega Death Defying Mega Cage match. Then open the throttle for the all Megacorp Hover by Grace, brought to you by Team Megacorp Racing. Hostile indigenous population not owned, endorsed, sponsored, supplied, advocated, or even liked by Megacorp. Approach to your own risk. The Megacorp Games! Keep it Mega! Dr. James T. Fullbladder reporting on Megacorp Experiment Number 13. This update is strictly classified. If you are watching this, you're fired. Early thinking held that the specimen was entirely docile in nature. Even overt provocation failed to incite it. But the late Dr. Putrid's son observed that natural levels of monster propanase in the experiment's bloodstream were triggering some remarkable changes. Attempts at neutralizing the specimen's violent tendencies were met with limited success. Our surviving staff recommend that the experiment be destroyed immediately at Megacorp's Deep Space Disposal Facility. Thugs for less! Pay for six hits and the seventh is free! You want us to what? Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. That'd be uh, an unethical conflict of interest. What kind of scum do you think we are? Say, that is a lot of bolts. <clears throat> well, since you put it that way, I suppose we could uh, undo our previous obligation. Excellent, sir. Thank you for choosing Thugs for Less. <clears throat> Attention all Thugs for Less personnel. We now have a new employer. Megacorp keeps you warm, keeps you healthy, and now keeps you safe. Hello, I'm Abercrombie Fizzwidget, and I'd like to welcome you to the new Megacorp Weapons Facility. We offer guided tours to show you how our weapons are made. Our highly trained experts spend their day creating the latest in heavy-duty weaponry to protect you and your whole family. So stop by today and bring the kids. Our tours are both informative and fun. And who knows? You just might learn something. Why is Billy sad? Is he cold? Hungry? Or maybe just... Oh no! No, 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 take it away! Lonely. Introducing the Megacore Protopet. Your child will shriek with joy when he meets our adorable friend. Wanna play ball? So does the Protopet. Need a partner for tag? Go find the Protopet. Up for some cops and robbers? Help! Police! So is you know who. Just ask Billy. No! The Megacore Protopet. Stop by Planet Bolden and get yours free from Abercrombie Fizzwidget himself. Listen up, thugs for less. We got a big job ahead, so pay attention. Uh, Megacorp has hired us to protect their CEO, Mr. Fizzwidget. They feel that he's getting a little, uh, you know, cuckoo in his old age and are concerned for his safety. The Fizzwidget's kind of old-fashioned, so I want everything handled with the... <coughs> Pride and courtesy people have come to expect from us. Also, be on the lookout for these two characters. I have a personal interest in seeing them rubbed out. So, I'm offering a free pizza party to the squad who bags them. And remember, that includes drinks and desserts. 
Over and out. Thugs for Less Prison would like to wish you a happy incarceration. After a poolside orientation, all new inmates will meet one-on-one -on -one with a galactic nutritionist. This professional will ensure that you're eating a species-appropriate diet for your entire stay. Next, come check out our fitness spa with your personal trainer. Remember, a prison term can feel twice as long if you're not in proper shape. And for those times when you're just feeling blue, come talk it out with one of our 10 full-time life coaches. They'll help you find your smile again. Thugs for Less Prison. Experience the maximum in security. Ratchet, Clank, I hope this gets through to you. I'm transmitting from the Thugs for Less fleet. This ship just returned from a megacorp distribution center, and I think I found the answer to... Uh, uh, achoo! Hey, who's there? Meow. Aww. What are you doing here? <laughs> Sending a message to your little pals, huh? Well, say goodbye, boys. <sighs> Take her to headquarters. What is your problem? I'm trying to make a living here, and you two losers keep lousing it up. Ratchet and Clank, isn't it? Yeah. Look, if you two don't hightail it back to your own galaxy, I'm gonna blast you into so many pieces you'll need a... Um, uh, well, there's gonna be a lot of them. I can tell you that. So you two hit the road, and don't bother trying to find me, cause I've got wind. Uh, I mean, I'm like the wind. You never know where I might show up next. And I blow hard, and I can be cooling on a warm summer day. And, uh, uh, well, you get the idea. Goodbye, morons! And now, Behind the Hero brings you the conclusion of our series on Captain Quark. As of this airing, the fugitive superhero has been missing for almost six weeks. Did he die heroically? Was he the victim of an overzealous fan? Or is he still out there somewhere? The galaxy may never know, but stay tuned for more baseless speculation and crackpot theories on Behind the Hero. Log entry 4792. Returning from Megacorp's distribution center. I'm beginning to suspect that Megacorp has lied to me. The extra-large decorative paperweights being stored there might actually be an enormous supply of protopets. Which might explain that the whole facility is guarded by ravenous mutant creatures. Their warehouse ship may hold as many as 10 million crates, and with 100 protopets per crate, that could be as many as, um, if, uh, to 3.5 zillion protopets. A secret shipment that large can only mean one thing. Megacorp is up to no good. I will confront them as soon as possible and demand a bigger cut of the action. Hello. Ratchet and Clank. You lucky devils. Angela Cross. Has just sent you a galactic greeting. Guys, if you get this message, please meet me on my home world. Just so you know, I found my old ID badge. I'm pretty sure we can still use it to infiltrate Megacorp HQ, but you're gonna have to hurry! Before the protopets completely overrun us! Oh, and uh, sorry for the balloonogram. It was the only thing I could get off this pl- We hope you enjoyed your galactic greeting! This is Garlic Ratch, reporting live from All Gone City where protopet mania is in full swing. For those who've spent the past week in hypersleep, the protopet is Megacorp's wildly popular bioengineered pet. Adorable, non-allergenic, and housebroken, fans of the creature have dubbed it the perfect companion. Between the protopet's surprisingly low price tag and its lightning-fast breeding cycle, there may soon be more than enough protopets for everyone. Darla Gratch, Channel 64 News. Mommy, where do protopets come from? Why, they come from Megacorp, dear. That's right, Mrs. Robot. All of the protopets in the galaxy come from right here, in our factory. Your little friend is lovingly extracted from the original protopet. 
Each protopet is given a name and birth certificate that is unique. Our training system helps mold your pet into a wonderful friend that you'll cherish forever. So the next time your child asks, Mommy, where do protopets come from? You can answer with confidence. They come from Megacorp. Bye now. Enjoy the Hygienator. <laughs> Remember, you bought it from Steve. <laughs> Steve McCork. Indeed. Now that I've sold my one millionth Hygienator, I can finance the comeback of the greatest superhero who ever lived. Captain Quark! All I need now is a new galaxy with a new fan base so I can rescue them from a new disaster! <laughs> so, what do you like to do for fun? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> So, whatever happened to Quark? I heard he was working at Megacorp. So, you fellas new here? You boys should sign up for the new Probomatic. That little baby cleans you something fierce. I just got done testing the full body waxinator. I am personally sporting a smooth chassis, and there are no tags on my luggage. All right then, catch you later. Subject 23A. Please report immediately for crotchetizer testing. Well, duty calls. All right, fellas. Nice and tight now. So you tested this, right? Oh, wait. That's why I'm here. <laughs> oh, one more thing. Ah!